Hey guys, it's Maddie here with a art uh, update and today I'm going to do a melted crayon design and it's going to look really cool in the end. Um, it's kind of like an abstract art so if you're really into like drawing and painting this is for you. Um, it's simple, it's really easy. Um, all you need is a pair, I mean a pack of crayons and a medium sized canvas. And this one is, I think, 16 by 20 canvas at Hobby Lobby, from Hobby Lobby. And um, you can get it, you can even get it at like Michael's or something. So um, I got the 64 pack, and I didn't necessarily use every color. I mean, there's still some crayons in there that I didn't use. But you can go ahead and use all the crayons if you want. Um, I just didn't want that many colors since it is a lot already. So, um, you're going to need that and you're going to need a blow dryer of some sort or um, some type of heat source. I would per I would suggest a blow dryer because it works the best. So, um, once you have that, um, let's get let's just go ahead and get started. Okay, so one thing I forgot to mention is to glue the crayons on. You'll need a hot glue gun. And you only need just a little bit. And um, so that's all. And I'm using a box just to hold it up. You don't have to have like one of those, um, I forget what it's called. But you don't have to have one of those. You could just use whatever. So um, you will need to cover your surface with um, newspaper if you've got some because this will splatter. So um, just have something to protect your table or your surface of what it, whatever you're working on. And um, you're going to um, set your blower, um, your hair dryer on hot. It's kind of faded, but you're going to need it on the highest heat you can get. And you don't have to have a nozzle. You can just use the regular thing. So um, put it on high and then high heat. So, um, okay, I guess we'll get started. Okay, so basically you're just going to keep going until you get every color you can possibly get. So basically I'm just going to finish up here because it is splattering a little bit on the camera and I don't want it to do that. So just keep going and um, I'll take a picture and video it when I'm done. Okay, so this is the final product and I thought it went very well. Um, with all the colors melted together, it created this beautiful artwork. And remember, it's not going to be perfect. So don't worry if you have some white spots, because it's not going to cover every part of the canvas. So I thought it turned out very, very well. And this is what it looks like at the bottom. Very splattered, very messy. Um, as you can tell, it kind of splattered over there a little bit. But it was very messy, so um, be sure before you ever begin something like this that um, you're well prepared. And of course it's splattered all over there too. And just be sure that you are comfortable with getting your blow dryer a little bit dirty. Um, of course it's going, to be, it's going to be easy to clean off with just a little bit of soap and water. So um, hot water, so um, yeah. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I'll talk to you later. Bye!